So what we'll be doing today is we're going to be revising our videos. These are videos that you've already finished, that are done, um, that you've made the way that you want them to. Um, but we're going to talk about revision as a way of changing up um, what we already have, of re-seeing our video as it already is. And it's much like we do in writing. So as we write, we add, we remove, we replace. Um, we delete different parts to affect our meaning and get a better get a meaning across. And the same thing will be true um, in our videos. So what I want to talk about first is as you guys were watching videos of your classmates, well, and some of you have passed back those papers that um, you started, what were some of the techniques that people used in their videos that you thought were cool or interesting or that you might like to try? Yeah, and I'll, I'll just make a list up here. Um, never mind. Huh? They put more than one video yes. in their video. All right, so that's a pretty good start with some different techniques. What I need you guys to do now is take out your day books, and we're just going to write for like five minutes to work out some of our thinking before we dig back into our projects. Take out your day books. All right, so just go to the next blank page in your day book, and there's a couple questions that may have the answer. First, write about what, what, what about your documentary worked well? So right now you're thinking about anything that didn't work or didn't go as you planned it. If you saw it going way in your head and when you actually did it, it looked differently, you ran into a problem. And as you finish writing about that, think about maybe we just, just right now we'll start small. One technique that you noticed in someone else's video that you'd like to try out in yours. And talk to your group about your video, how it went and what you're planning on trying out in your process, in your revision process today. You may um, have some questions. Now's a great time to ask people in their group if they're in your group if maybe they've tried these things out or they know how to do it. Um, and also, you might be able to contribute to other people if they're, if they're stuck or have questions. And feel free to respond freely to any of their ideas. Okay, take two minutes and share with the group. Go. My project wasn't that great, and like my screenshots and interviews, like I probably don't have like a whole bunch of like teachers, students, like different people, like just on their outlook of college period. But I think my my project sucked. <laughs> What tech, one technique that you noticed someone else using and you want to use in your video? When they had um, like a picture or a slide and it was like moving up and then they had like their little words in the corner with like little points and then like the designs around it was like really cool. I'm definitely going to What about you, Angelita? But um, like I kind of like Michael because like I was trying to put the text like not necessarily because I didn't want to use the um, the eye moving ones because like they would cover up the whole thing. You really want to switch it to like the last second. But like, I was trying to see what like Michael was using because instead of using the eye moving, he used something else to put like the stuff around it. And like I wanted to do that, but I, didn't, I never asked him, so. What like there was a lot of information and I didn't know where to start and to show like all the websites. Um, after I showed the the clutter of the website, I put a picture of the website evaluation to, to like show like how I got the information and how I categorized the information. Alright, so for our workshop time, just I'm just going to give you some general guidelines, and then we're going to take some time just to revise. And remember, same thing with revision as with writing. We either add, reorder, replace, or delete. Like Those are the same moves that you'll make as, with, as when you write. Um, so, our workshop time, here's what you can do. You can try out new techniques that you notice in other people's videos. So that's what a lot of you have already talked about and are planning on doing. You can fix up areas of your project that didn't go as well as you planned. Um, you can conference with people, maybe in your writing group, or I was talking to, I was listening to Angelita. She noticed something that Michael did in his. You may want to go over and find Michael and talk to him. Yeah, you can get it. That's fine. Um, and you can also view other people's projects if you feel like you need to go and look at Michael's again to see what he was doing. So it is a 
individual time, collaborate as needed, but please be sure that you are, are being respectful of people who are recording, um, because some people are recording different parts of the projects. Okay, so we'll do this for like 15 minutes and we'll see what we come up with. All right? And then I put it on magazine, and then I, I put it into the whole class. And they talked about how college had Greek life, uh, sports, and the class was there with me. So, what, are you, what are you revising? I guess I should ask. Uh, Our PowerPoint. Making it better? I want to make, like, I have lots of pictures and graphs mm -hmm. and stuff, and I want to, like, explain why I put these in there mm -hmm. and what they have to do with my project. Cool. So how are you going to do that? I'm going to... Uh, I don't know. Okay. Should I just do it? I think I'm going to put, like, captions and, mm. like, arrows and stuff to show what I mean by these graphs. Cool. So what... You may need to use, what, are you going to do that with an iMovie? Yeah, but I'm going to use explain everything for the, like, writing part. And you're going to screenshot yeah. the slides? Oh, that's what I'm doing. Okay, awesome. cool. Me too. What classes do you think you should take in high school? You should prepare for the classes you want to take in college. I have learned that the classes you take in high school prepare you for what you want to do in college. If you take on this class, you can get a B in it. It's better than taking an easy class and getting an A in it. Because you're challenging yourself more. Take all the classes you need and have some of the better classes for later because everything you do will be on your college career. Alright, so how are you revising it right now? Um, showing how I learned the college recipes and in depth for college recipes. Yes. Okay, Why, so is that something that you're adding to your video? Why? Because I didn't have it in there before. Okay, yeah, and that was kind of important. All right, that's cool. How's it going? How are you showing that? Videotaping myself for what I learned about college. Okay, so you're just including you talking about it. All right, where'd you get that idea? <laughs> that's cool. How about you, Margarita? Um, I'm just changing the background and the music, and I'm when I add the background, I'm trying to bring the um, the font and the pictures up, but I'm still trying to figure it out. Okay, so how are you trying to figure it out? Like, what are you doing to learn okay. how to do that? I'm doing the help thing, and then it's just telling me to go to the second. Mm -hmm. When I put a background on here, my, um, my words and my font are really thin. Mm -hmm. And it won't let me edit it because I did it and explained everything. Oh, yeah. I wonder how you fix that. Hmm, so the problem is what, like the iMovie theme? Yeah. Okay. I know, but like in, uh, in iMovie, because like this is what I did at the end. So that like, seems to I work. I clicked on text and like it was brighter because it went over the, the thing. Okay. So yeah, let's, tr let's try that and see if it works. Mostly all the stuff I want to put in my video, mm -hmm. but the order, like I'm not sure of the order and I need music. Okay. So, you, what, what, do you use Explain Everything? I use iMovie. Okay. But I thought you started in Explain Everything. No. Oh, you didn't? You used the whole no, thing? I was using Explain Everything to, like, type stuff. Mm -hmm. And then I snapshot it and then put it in iMovie. Okay. But now I need music and I... Uh, no. Yeah, and like the order, I'm not sure that I have this in the right order. Okay. Well, how do you know if it's in the right order? It's kind of confusing. It but is. But I think it, like, I... It depends on what part you're trying to The ending. This whole interview, yeah. Why do you want to delete that? Because, like, no matter what I do, you can't hear her. Okay. Because, like, your education doesn't just end, like, at high school. Like, if you think about it, what was the point of going? Are you like, Yes. What do you think it means to be college? Turn over. 
welcome. I did, Addison. Oh. <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> what do you think it means to be Calistrian? All right, Giselle, I see you, like, working through different, going back to different applications, and what are you, what are you doing? Um, I'm going to explain everything. I'm sorry. Right. That's cool. <laughs> I'm going to explain everything. It's like typing what I write and, like, edit pictures, mm -hmm. highlight things, and then screenshot it and put it on my Okay, cool. How did you think to do that? Because, um, I don't know, I, I saw, I saw explain everything and um, I, you said there's two other choices so I just Okay. And do you, how do you feel like it's working? It's pretty good. Okay. Get there. Get where? Where she's at. Why don't you ask her? She didn't tell me. Oh, my bad Marie. You go to explain everything. Where's that at? Oh, my computer. Oh, it's right there. Oh, you got the... <laughs> so what's the problem? <laughs> I don't know how to do what I'm trying to do. I honestly don't know what I'm trying to do. Like, it's very... Okay. I'm trying to change the background on this picture, and I can't do it. I don't know if I can do it either. This is very Ms. frustrating. Paul, please go to the restroom. Okay. Um, so what are you going to try? Try, I'm going to try using, um, but, oh, we don't have Doodle Buddy anymore. Oh, I think it's off. I think you took it off. I'm going to try to use Ink Flow. Okay. Do you even know what that's for? Yeah. Oh, you do? A little bit. <laughs> All right, let me know, because I haven't even played with that one yet. Oh, look at that. I think that will work. Awesome discovery, Dontaria. All right, so what I want to do next is, it seemed like we had a really productive revision session. Um, it seemed like there were some things that people struggled with and some things that went really well for people. Um, so let's just talk about and share what we did and how it went. Yeah, Tyree. Uh, I tried to see, like, all the little back pain. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I failed. Oh, yeah. why, did you, why did you consider that a failure? Um, well, at first, like, I was just gonna put pictures and graphs and then like summarize the information that I had and all of that didn't go as planned. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, okay. I think mine is going to be better, like I'm working on it now. I had like unnecessary interviews in there and like they was going on and on about a whole nother topic. So I think now and then I'm gonna add like some more describing details about my whole inquiry because I don't, I don't think I really need like extra people in my video. I think I need to focus on what I learned before I try to teach others about what they need to learn or what they need to know. How about you two over here? Did it go well or not so much? Um, well, when I added the background, the text was really, really faint and I couldn't edit it because I had to leave it somewhere else. So I tried to um, record myself talking about it over it, but the length of the slides isn't really working out. So I'm going to have to work with that, like make it longer. Okay, cool. How was this? Did anybody notice any connection between this process and the process uh, that you go through when you're writing? Yeah. All right, can you, can you talk about what this was like? An experience you've had with writing? Okay, because like with writing, like I like my stuff to be like on point, but sometimes I overthink and then whenever I put it down on paper, I'm like, no, like this does not work. So like whenever we did like the inquiry project, it's like I overthink thought and I was like, oh yes, this is going to be so good together. And then I put it down on I was like, what have I put myself into? Like none of it went together. Like I think if I would have thought it out like <coughs> a little bit more and like drew it out like I was supposed to before, <laughs> I think that my video would have been better. So. But yeah, it's like, I think it's somewhat like whenever you write. Cool. Anybody else want to talk about the connection between this and when you write? Hi. All right. Hey, you all rock. Thank you so much. We're good, Lexus. <laughs>